We are so excited to announce our new planner option for you here in your dashboard where you're now able to schedule your videos to post all the way up to a month in advance. So if you look in your dashboard, you'll see now that you have this new little tab on the side that says planner. If you click on it, you can see that you now have a calendar that you can toggle between our current month and the following month. And then any videos that you schedule will show up here. So what I wanna do is show you how you can get your videos on to your scheduler. So we'll go ahead and go into our catalog and we're able to get videos on a few different ways. So if you wanna go ahead and select from a video that Minta has already created for you here from these use cases up top, you can go ahead and scroll through, pick one you like that's already done, and just hit the share button at the bottom. And I am going to go ahead and schedule this one to Instagram. So we'll go ahead and select Instagram. I will select my Instagram account here. And then you're able to type in your caption anything that you'd like. I'm just gonna type some gibberish here for now for this example. Um, you also wanna make sure you add your hashtags here. So hashtag, you know, baby girl clothes, whatever it may be, um, add as many hashtags as possible. And then you're gonna go ahead and hit schedule. This is where you are able to choose the date. So I will go ahead and pick tomorrow, hit done. And then we can click our time here and then hit done. And all you have to do is click apply. Now, this video has been put on to your planner. We can go ahead and take a quick look at that here. We'll go to planner. And you will see that that video is now on our calendar. If for any reason you need to make a change to that post, you can click on it from the calendar. You're able to modify the date and time. You can continue to add more to your captions. And then you would just hit apply here. If for some reason you decide you don't want that one to post, you can just hit the delete button there. I'm going to go ahead and hit delete just so this accidentally doesn't post since I haven't really typed in text that I would want. Um, go ahead and delete scheduled post. All right, now we're going to head back to calendar and I'm going to show you another way that you can schedule videos for your calendar. So let's say you have a specific product that you want to promote this week or specific products. I like to click on the product video tab just because this one happens to have some of the templates that I like most. And I'll go ahead and type up here the product that I want to create a video for. I want to do a Mr. Wonderful birthday outfit. So I'll start typing Mr. Wonderful. Then I click on the outfit that I want, which is here. And now Minta is populating that product into all of the templates here on this screen for me. So all I'm gonna have to do is choose a template that I like. I personally don't like to make any tweaks because I just like to get as many videos out as quick as I possibly can. And that's what's most important. So I don't even modify them. Um, I like the ones that kind of focus on the product most. So I'll go ahead and hit show more here for the templates. Find the template that I like. I actually typically use the same one for all of my posts, even though they give us a huge variety. Um, I'm okay using the same one. So I'm just gonna go ahead and find it, which is here. And then I'm gonna schedule down at the bottom. This time we'll go ahead and do it to Facebook. You're able to schedule to your Instagram, Facebook, or Pinterest, but I'm gonna click Facebook for this example. Select my Facebook page. Here is where I would type in my caption, you know, first birthday outfit, ah. you know, whatever you wanna type. And then you would hit schedule here, just like we did previously. Then we choose the time. I'll go ahead and pick Tuesday and excuse me, the date, now we select the time. Let's do 12, hit done. And then I'm going to hit apply. And it is simple as that, you guys. And now I have another video scheduled. So I didn't even have to create my own content. Minta created it for me. And now I can schedule it all the way up to a month in advance. Amazing. Okay, so as you can see, it's on the calendar. I'm gonna show you guys one last trick that um, you can do if you're one of those that likes to go in and tweak 
a bunch of diff videos, like the text and the colors and all of that, and you s happened to have saved them for later in your favorites, you can actually go and save a bunch of videos. Oops. You can actually go save a bunch of videos at one time by clicking the heart and then going over to your saved and you'll see here all of the saved videos that you have and then let's say you wanted to create 20 videos all at once um, that you've picked different products and or you've saved some that Minta populated and then you wanted to do your scheduling all at once you could just hit the hearts to save them for later and then all you have to do is individually go into each one of these click on the scheduler and then just schedule as you would like the other two examples previously. So you have several ways of getting these videos onto your planner. And like I said, from the actual planner side, once you've already scheduled them at the individual video level, you can come in here, click on it in your calendar and make any changes that you need to. I hope this video helped and happy planning.